Hey, good morning, everyone. I'm Wes Irwin, and this is my Moose's LZ Bar and Grill Morning Minute, uh, coming to you from Williams Grove Speedway in Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. Um, uh, just pulled in a little bit ago. I'm inside the Toter home here. Uh, pulled in the pit road here. We always park off to the side until we can pull our trailers in tomorrow. Uh, really nice. We raced at Lincoln Speedway last night. Good stuff. Uh, the crowd was great. Uh, it was good to see a lot of uh, fans that come to Lincoln Speedway I haven't seen in a while. Um, but not a long drive from uh, Lincoln to Williams Grove. They're about 23 miles apart. So, you know, a little over half an hour drive. Not much. Half an hour, maybe. Uh, so, yeah, we're just going to park here. Got to do some cleaning up in here. Uh, I haven't cleaned house in a while, so I got to catch up on that. So, uh, yes, I know that there's rain in the forecast and everybody else does too that uh, works out here or races cars. Just so you people know that like to tell us that it's going to rain. Uh, we watch the weather too. We have to. So uh, don't need anybody to tell us about the weather this weekend. We know it's iffy, but fingers crossed. That's all you can do. We're here. We're in Pennsylvania. We're ready to race. We don't drive around to not race. Uh, we're not in this business to not race. So uh, please, no negative uh, rain comments and Williams Grove comments on on my morning minute or anything like that. Any any place I uh, post anything, but um, yeah, we're my, my fingers are crossed, you know. And uh, there's a lot of campers here already, so you know these people out here, uh, the ones that are dedicated to racing, they're not so worried about worrying about the weather all the time. They're just going to be confident. Uh, they're here to have a good time, and uh, I agree with them. So um, it is on the chillier side than it was yesterday. Definitely only going to hit about 68, I believe. So. Um, yeah, I also want to thank, uh, one of my living like outlaws, youth programmer, program drivers, Brielle Stern. She came out last night to Lincoln Speedway to hang out with us. And, uh, she's a lot, she's a fun kid. I ate, uh, dinner with her and her dad over at, uh, Rock's Lounge two nights ago. So, uh, just, a a great family, a great kid. And I'm glad that she's on my program. I'm glad all my kids are, and I need to catch up on their videos. Uh, I'm really behind, but these midweek races and driving in between kind of, uh, take a toll on me. So uh, we'll get caught up here. We've got a lot of kids now, so uh, can't really take much more uh, uh, youth program drivers right now. But for those of the, you are asking, but yeah, we'll get, uh, we'll get cleaned up in here. I'll probably uh, get the scooter out of the trailer right over to uh, TJ Rockwell's kind of tradition to go over there Thursday late afternoon and hang out over there, get some dinner, get some wings. They got great wings over there. Uh, hopefully somebody, some of you guys will, will be around. Jen Shade said she might stop by, so I haven't seen Jen Shade in a while. For you people that live around here in central Pennsylvania, know who she is. She's been uh, uh, on 105.7 The X for, well, she's been in radio business forever. Uh, one of the greatest DJs and friends I, I know. So hopefully we'll catch up with her. I haven't seen her in a long time, and uh, she's always fun to hang out with. So, um, yeah, that's about it. I'm rambling on. But, uh, yep, sitting here, so if you're in the area... You want to have some cold ones, you want to do something, you want to hang out, I'll have, uh, hopefully maybe have a fire going later. If anybody wants to drop off some firewood to me, uh, I'll get a fire going here tonight and put the awning out. So um, that's it. That's all I got for you. You guys have a great day. Stay positive and keep smiling.